The refugee crisis has been one of the world's greatest challenges in 2015. Large groups of people are fleeing violence and poverty from Syria, Iraq, Afghanistan, and other countries. Since 1980, the Jesuit Refugee Service has been working to help these types of people. Now, they're busier than ever. And with the Jubilee, they've launched a new program, Mercy in Motion. Uh, when Pope Francis announced that we would be having a Holy Year of Mercy in 2016, JRS began to reflect on how we might be able to respond to that call. And we went back to our own roots and our own sense of mission, and we rediscovered that what we really want to be about is education. The objective of the campaign is to almost double the number of refugees that receive formation by 2020. They want to go from 120,000 currently to 220,000 in more than 50 countries. Education is life. You cannot, they, no one can have a life without education. They will, they will be isolated in the, the other country without an education. They will be still living in their problem and in, in all the, in all the clashes and all the conflict that they have been seeing. When we try to educate them, what we see is we changing them to other type of life, make them, give them the hope of their future. And education can't be done in just any manner. The program particularly wants to reach young people who are in danger of not receiving proper formation. We want to offer to refugees the option of accessing university education. Currently, only 1% of them study at universities, and so we are starting a program with universities in the United States that will let them study online. They want to create sustainable solutions for people that are suffering through a difficult situation for long periods of time, and they need all the help they can get. In this campaign, we are asking for volunteers and funds, but it is also a campaign that is going to arrive in parishes, in religious congregations and organizations. We are going to mobilize all kinds of collaborators. The Jesuit organization also doesn't want people to forget about the more than 8 million people displaced within Syria. There are 60 million refugees in the world, a similar number to how many there were following the Second World War.